to another episode of Talking with Docs. I am Dr. Paul Zalzo. And I'm Dr. Brad Weening. So we got a great video today. We're going to demonstrate how a cast is removed. With a cast saw. Yeah. People who have a cast on and let's say it's time to get the cast off or get it changed. A lot of people are anxious about how is this cast going to get cut off? Is it going to cut my skin? Is it going to hurt? They hear yeah. the word saw and they think. Yeah. Sure. It's scary. So show us what a saw is. This is a cast saw. This is a cast saw. So it looks old but this is actually a new saw and the cool thing about this round blade is that it doesn't go all the way around it actually just shakes it has little teeth on it that shakes and it makes lots of noise unfortunately that's one of the things that scares the younger patients the most i think is the noise it's loud it's and if you add a vacuum to it to collect the dust it's even louder. it's even louder so we're just gonna turn on for a second it makes a loud noise Right. Does it cut skin, Dr. Weening? So, um, it is designed to not cut skin. It will uh, kind of rub against your skin if there is constant pressure held there, but it does not cut through the skin. So I'm actually going to demonstrate that now on um, Paul. What? Yeah. All right. Here we go. Wait, are you sure it doesn't cut skin? I'm quite confident. Like, wait, 80% confident. Maybe don't go right over the radial <laughs> artery. I'm going to go just on the fat of his hand. Ah! <laughs> is that scary? You get scary. So you can see here, and then show your hand. Yeah, it doesn't cut skin. All right, so it vibrates, it doesn't spin, it just vibrates, so it cuts through the cast, and there's still some padding under the cast, so it probably won't cut your skin, but it could get hot and burn if the cast tech uh, holds it there for a very long time, but the cast saws off and moves along. And that's why we got one of our colleagues who is a cast technician to take a cast off and show you in a video. All right, let's cue it up. Okay, so this is a cast cutter. Sounds like a chainsaw that doesn't cut skin, okay? So it's very safe. But as soon as, as soon as I'm the cast, cut it by my way, okay? There we go. So I'm gonna cut all the way here, all the way down there, okay? Okay. I'm just gonna ask you no moving, okay? How'd that feel, buddy? Did that hurt? No, not at all. Right. Now we're gonna spread that cast like opening nuts. Right. There you are. That's good. Now we're gonna do the same here. Carlos, I think we want to keep this cast. Oh yeah, he can keep it. Look at all the signatures. For sure, yeah. And now we're gonna cut the linen inside, okay? Okay. But the most important is I don't cut with this, okay? They don't cut skin, they are safety. There you are, so now this part can come out. Awesome. What's the first thing you're gonna do, scratch? Yeah. Nice. Now we cut this part here. Buddy, thank you very much for letting us film that. Oh. 
So that was a really cool video, seeing, uh, seeing that the cast doesn't hurt people. Yeah, that was, I'd, I'd like to thank uh, our patient and uh, the mom for giving consent for us. He's actually a really cool kid. He's quite a, quite a competitive athlete in okay. uh, training. That's how he injured his ankle. Uh, and he's about four weeks in, so we're just changing the cast, taking it down to a lower cast now. And that was a fiberglass uh, cast that you cut that off? That was a fiberglass cast that Carlos uh, cut off. So thanks to, to Carlos for uh, demonstrating it, and uh, we hope you enjoyed it. And if you like this video, please like it and subscribe to our channel. And don't ever try and cut your cast off yourself at home, please. Because people do that. Yeah, we've seen that. Don't do that. See you next time.